Smoking was like the be all or end all for me. If I didn't quit this time, I felt like I would have lost so much respect for myself. I quit before I lost the weight, and then I quit after I lost the weight. This was the fourth time I quit. Life is good. Life right now is it's at a good point. Yeah, yeah. It's a it's stressful, but it's a good point. It's graduation. Do you mind the stress? Mm. Would you prefer no stress? Well, everyone, yeah, everyone prefers no stress, but I feel like as a well, person, I'm always it. stressed. I'm always stressed. Probably why I took up smoking in the first place, but I'm a really stressful person. Um, but stress pushes you. I hate my job, I really hate driving a cab, so if anything in the slightest happens that's like annoying, my whole didn't I? my whole night is ruined, literally. Right. So I'm like, we'll be smoking even more. It's just like it's a dick not shock you said it's like a, a trigger. Yeah, it's a it's a trigger. Like anything that triggers you will cause you to wanna to eliminate that stress trigger, you know? So smoke a cigarette. My friend um, told me, you know, everyone tells you you're gonna die young, you're gonna die from cancer, you're gonna die young, you're gonna die young. It's like, okay, we get it. Like, I'll die young. Like, everyone else is dying young. You know, like, people are dying at seven years old. You think that's normal? No, it's not normal. But the thing that was, like, the biggest factor was you're gonna die ugly. That was like, it hit me at a point where it was like, that's so true. You know, like wrinkles around your mouth, around your eyes, your skin droops, your teeth gets even yellower than they are right now. Like, you know, like your nails, like it's just nothing is pretty. Like nothing is pretty when you're a smoker at all. It's disgusting. It affects like, your sleep, your metabolism, your lungs, your brain, your heart, your nerve system, your central nervous system, like, everything. It attacks it. Directly when I stopped quit, when I stopped smoking, sorry, I was so much more energetic. Like so much more energetic, like my work with that was annoying, like how <laughs> hyper I was, and it's like, you, you really feel it, like your body's like, yo, thank you, you know, like, <laughs> your body was like, thank you so much for this, that you quit, like, thank you, and yeah, that was a good thing. Well, like, I like helping people, it's fun, like, it's just, when you give advice, and like, I always feel like I'm always in a, in a, a, a good place when I'm in an advisory role, mm -hmm. so I'm sitting there in front of someone, like, one-to-one, -one, like, I can, like, really, like, I feel like I can give good advice and I can give them a good direction in life. Addiction is such a weird thing. Addiction is not what we think it is. Addiction is when you are addicted to the when you're addicted to something and you have a support system around you, someone people who love you and people who care for you, you are more inclined to stay in that environment rather than like walk off to go grab your smoke or yeah snort your line or you know like any of those things it's a addiction's a very it's like a lot of the information we have today on addiction is like not wrong per se but it's very misorientated where it's like when i'm with my boyfriend for like let's say the whole day i'll have i used to have like two cigarettes when i was at school i would have like 15 in a day so it's a huge change right because when you're comfortable and you're safe and you're secure and happy you just addiction's not it's, you're not it's not really running through your mind because you're like no 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 the life stresses are like Pushing you to be like, oh, do this, smoke this, you know, like get it, get rid of it. Kyle to me symbolizes like a sense of freedom, you know, like I, I'm me around him. His parents love me to death. I'm me around his parents all the time. I'm gay around his parents, you know, like very flamboyant as much as I wanted to. It doesn't matter. You're comfortable. Like yeah, that's like you know, kind of a home. To anyone trying to kick any kind of addiction, I suggest that you look deep enough and try to pinpoint why you do what you do.